All right. So, um, but the next drug we should be talking about is what is known as what? Oxytetracycline. Oxytetracycline. Now, for this oxytetracycline, you can see how this how the drug looks like. All right. You see how it looks like. So, if this is the human version. Is like the animal version, so you have it for animals and also for humans. Okay, so so that it's a broad spectrum antibiotic. Broad spectrum meaning that it can act on several types of bacteria. Okay, it can act on several types of bacteria. So um, how does it act? It actually inhibits what protein synthesis. So it inhibits protein synthesis, right? So it has a bacteriostatic effect. So it binds to the 30S ribosomal subunit of the bacteria. So this will now pre prevent what? Binding of amino isotrna to the mRNA ribosome complex. So if you inhibit that, uh, okay, so that whole process will now inhibit the formation and elongation of polypeptide chain. So it will now further disrupt the bacterial protein synthesis, right? Absorption is well absorbed orally with a bioavailability of 75 to 80%. But when you give this drug together with things like food, milk, it basically what affect, uh, it will affect the absorption, right? Then distribution is widely throughout the body. Metabolism, it is not extensively metabolized. It is excreted primarily in urine, about 60%, and in feces, about 40%. Elimination half-lives approximately 8 hours. So adverse effects when you are using this drug, you can be expecting things like what? Nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, abdominal pain. The serious side effects could include things like phototoxicity, esophageal irritation, tooth discoloration, enamel hypoplasia, intracranial hypertension. Warning is you shouldn't use it in children that are under 8 years, or pregnant women, or breastfeeding mothers, because there's a risk of what? Tooth discoloration and abnormal bone growth. Clinical use is used to treat respiratory tract infections like pneumonia, bronchitis, the skin infections like acne, rosacea, sexually transmitted infections such as um, chlamydia, gonorrhea, other infections like what? Um, cytokosis, cholera, acute intestinal what? amoebiasis. Let me just write something down. Yeah, I got my point. I think that's it for this oxy tetracycline.